here and welcome to Cheat Clean Eats. Today I'm gonna to show you how to make three 20 day reset breakfast. Everybody loves breakfast because it helps you get started for your entire day and you wanna set that tone strong. Get your workout in, eat something good, and then when you're heading to school or work, you are like, on your way to success. So 28 Day Reset, just gonna quickly remind you, it's not a diet, it is a way for you to find your food sensitivities and intolerances. So for 28 days, you're gonna take out any alcohol, added sugar, dairy, gluten, as well as processed foods. And you'll notice that your skin and your body is just gonna be glowing. So if you're not sure what kind of stuff to make, well, I'm gonna show you. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and start breakfast. Time to get fancy. Now add your nutritional yeast to some garlic seasoning and salt and pepper. This is going to be your coating for your polenta. So slice up a hearty piece, coat on all sides with coconut oil, and then make sure you cover every square centimeter of your polenta. Now heat up your pan to medium and give it a little fry and a little flip, about a couple minutes each side until crispy golden brown. Then quickly heat up your Canadian bacon. Notice how round it is and how it fits perfectly on top of the polenta. I'm dying at how cute that is. Now two slices of avocado, adding some green color. And now we attempt to make poached eggs. So basically, crack your egg into some boiling water and let it sit for a couple minutes and then take it out. I mean, it's really not that hard. It looks so fancy. I mean, look at that. Now top it off with some salt and pepper and some nutritional yeast and boom. Oh my gosh. This breakfast is totally next level. Say hello to our friend, the spiralizer, AKA the torturer of fruits and veggies. Just kidding, they make them so pretty, isn't it amazing? Okay, so to start our pancake batter, all you need are two fresh eggs, add a little bit of almond flour, a little bit of coconut flour, some baking powder, some unsweetened applesauce, and mix it up. Oh my gosh, look at that beautiful yellow color. Now, on a medium low pan, you're gonna wanna fry those pancakes and I'm getting about four of these. Oh my goodness, add a little bit of nut butter on top, whatever is your favorite, and some of that spiralized apple. And if you're feeling fancy, a pinch of cinnamon. <gasps> Look at that, pancakes. Who doesn't love pancakes for breakfast? So yummy, Oh. It's pudding for breakfast that you can make the night before. So go ahead and add some nut milk with some frozen cherries and some rolled oats to give it that heartiness, some chia seeds to fluff it up, some stevia, and blend it. Ooh, look at that pink color. Oh my gosh, I wish you guys could smell this right now. It is so amazing. Now put it in a cute little mason jar, cap it, and you're gonna chill overnight in your fridge. Notice how it's going to change color. It's a little bit darker. And now we are going to add some toppings to make it fonts. So some cherries, some slivered almonds, and oh my gosh, this is basically Pinterest worthy in taste and in looks. Those are our three 28 day reset breakfasts. Oh my gosh, they look so delicious. I can't even choose which is, is my favorite. I mean, I always love pancakes, but these really took breakfast to a whole nother level. Pretty much one of my first times ever doing a poached egg and I feel pretty fancy and it wasn't that hard. So you guys should definitely, definitely try it. Remember, the 28 day reset is not a diet. It is a way for you to find your food sensitivities and intolerances and you will find that your skin will glow and your body is going to change. So guys, let me know in the comments below which one of these were your favorite and I will see you next time. Bye, love you so much.